Hey guys, it's Davey here from PhoneBuff.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to set your own custom ringtone on your Android phone. So uh, first things first, I want to show you how to set your ringtone to begin with. So what you're going to do is go to your settings. You can also press uh, from the home screen menu and then settings, but in this case I'm just going to go to the settings icon. doesn't matter how you get here as long as you get here. Go to sound once you're here though and uh, you can see right here you have an option for phone ringtone. So when I hit this, you see I have a whole bunch of uh, ringtones in this list. These are just pretty much the stock ones that come with Android. And uh, if I wanted to set one, I can just tap it, hit OK, and I've changed my ringtone. But let's say the song I wanted or MP3 file I wanted isn't included in here. So the way I could make it show up in that list is I go over to a file explorer. So I've downloaded the ES file explorer from the Android market. It's free and I definitely recommend it. Um, what you want to do is from your uh, the very root of the phone as far as you could go you want to go over to a folder called ringtones now if that folder doesn't exist you should create it by pressing menu and then new and then of course you hit folder and then name it ringtones but I already have it created so what I want to do is go over to my music file where I have all my music stored and uh, let's say I wanted to make uh, this song my ringtone so what I'll do is copy it and then hit back and go over to ringtones and then I'm just gonna go ahead and paste it so paste right there and uh, there you go I've pasted it into the ringtones file and now when I go over to my settings and then go into my ringtone list you'll see that it actually shows up right there so I hit it hit OK and I've got the song that I wanted as my ringtone and uh, this same uh, thing applies when you're trying to do uh, text message notifications as well it would show up in a folder called notifications right here so I already have the ones I have but if you wanted to something else as your text message notification, you just paste it in here and uh, it'll show up in the list when you go to set it. Alright, that's it for me in this video. This is Dave from PhoneBuff.com. Thank you for watching it and don't forget to visit PhoneBuff.com for more cell phone news, reviews, and how-tos. Thank you.